Greetings and salutations, your average rider here. Let's talk how to pack for an overnight motorcycle trip. So I'm about to embark on a multi-day motorcycle trip of my own. I'm going with a few family members and I figured why not take this opportunity to show you how I pack for an overnight motorcycle trip. I mentioned in a previous video that I'm very much a list kind of guy, so I like to use Google Keeps I mentioned. I have it where I can tick off the items as I go. I'd like to share this list with you, but the best way I think I can do it is just, I'll just copy and paste it into the description of this video below and take with it as you will. Uh, this is the first time I'm doing a multi-day trip with my Honda here. I'm very excited. I have my Shad SH23 side bags as well as my new tank bag. So uh, I am always love motorcycle trips. So yeah, let's get right into it. I'm now back from my motorcycle trip and I want to tell you guys a few things. I First off, I truly cannot wait to share my, my video footage with you guys. Give me a couple weeks to do that. Now, getting back to the storage, I find it a little bit funny. The more storage that I have, the more that I want. I used to be okay on my Bonneville here with a Krieger US 20 and a US 5 pack case 25 liters at best and now i've got 23 times two of my shads plus a five liter tank bag yet i feel like i could use some more i'm planning a trip to alaska in the next few years and i am thinking that i'm gonna probably want a, a shad top case on the honda before i do that trip as well well thanks so much for watching please like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one